I appreciate it. Yeah. Yes, sir. She could go grab you Just one. had one. She offered one to Shad. Who can't have one? So. <laughs> <laughs> he almost said yes. He was like, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. He probably wants to. He was like, after tonight, yeah, yeah, I think I'll take that. Yeah. We good? All right, guys. We've got Tough Cooper here who got it done tonight in round number nine. So, I mean, it's kind of been a, it's been really interesting tie down. <laughs> I mean, really interesting. I mean, you guys are used to three under on the barrier and this whole setup here is, uh, pretty awesome but i mean just iconic it feels totally different than vegas out there but i mean what's your opinion of it all i mean you're so used to yeah Thomas right and mac yeah right yeah it's 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 taken a second to really obviously it's taken nine rounds for me <laughs> to figure this out <laughs> um but it, we're so grateful to have it yeah but, you know the 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 measurements of the arena the dimensions they're they're so different than anything we've ever been to so it's taken a little bit of time to uh you know get used to it and for all of us really yeah uh, and like i said it's it's been super strange you yeah know, um, for everybody yeah i mean we've we've seen a lot of things that i don't think any of us who uh who follow tie down or, or just rodeo in general would have probably picked the way each of these rounds have gone i mean i seriously the fact that hunter came back and, and won <laughs> two rounds placing two others i mean i wouldn't have thought that could, could happen for him so it's uh it's been really interesting and uh you uh, you did a horse change tonight. You jumped on uh, Cade's horse, and, yeah. and it seemed like it maybe was a good decision i mean you got out perfect hit the barrier right where you needed to and uh I mean, what, you took, like, two extra swings. Yeah, 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 yeah. Like, yeah. Okay, it went pretty far to be six, work. yeah. I mean, that was <laughs> that was pretty impressive. I mean, that might have been the cleanest run we've seen the whole time. So, yeah, yeah, yes, yeah. sir. I mean, y your groundwork was perfect. You beat the calf to the ground, it seemed like. And it, it, <laughs> it was just, it was beautiful. So congratulations on that. But, uh, I mean... One more round to go. I mean, what do you what do you think is going to happen? I mean, it is even though you're in the middle of it, it's like you just got to be like, what is going to happen? I, here? For the last two days, I've been asking all of my fellow tie down ropers that you know are actually know or that, that that are really you know invested into you know their the sport. Like, what do you think is going to happen? You know, yeah. like obviously I've been out of the runnings for a while for right. the last few rounds, and I was like, what? Well, like, all right, what do you think is going to happen? And you know, it's the, everybody. It's the everybody's picks different it's it's yeah. kind of been crazy uh you know tough luck for solomon tonight getting the getting the barrier you know that opens the door for shane you know takes the pressure off shane but you know it's it's coming down the 10th round it always comes down the 10th round it's it strange well, i mean the you know? sixty-seven thousand in the yeah, average it's a game it's changer huge, yeah. in everything except Absolutely. for like the barrels right now yeah <laughs> no one's touching haley but uh <laughs> right yeah, unbelievable i mean that's just been nuts to watch it has been absolutely amazing for you know for for everybody just yes. to sit back and watch you know Haley and sister just it's crazy do that their a horse thing. like that is like a, even exists <laughs> right it's like there's something there like half robot I don't know what it is <laughs> but I mean you're kind of one of the one of the foremost guys doing tie down right now you, you're always at the front of the pack being an advocate for the sport being an advocate for the kind of person you need to be to represent the rodeo lifestyle the western lifestyle that we all love and care about which is something i truly appreciate about uh about you you don't have to do that you could you know do other things <laughs> i mean no one would fault you for doing that but uh it being able to have and you said the greatest line <laughs> you know, what you said it in your in your interview with amy real quick you were like it's been 2020 for all of us yeah and it's been 2020 for me here i think that is something that just resonates so good i hope they just put that on <laughs> there's probably so many people who need to hear that you know it, it but the cool thing about us we wear cowboy hats we're cowboys and cowgirls yep. and we're not going to give up we're not going to give in no matter what we're going to finish this thing out to the end yep. it doesn't matter what it, they throw in front of us we will figure out a way you know we're so thankful that the prca and the texas rangers arlington fort worth were able to put this thing together i mean we had a season with fans we had an nfr with fans live on television yep i mean we are doing things as an industry we will not give up, and that's the message that that we all tell each other every day when we wake up and look each other in the eyes. Like, okay, what do we got? You know, twenty twenty. Okay, we got it. We'll figure it out. We'll figure out the process. You know, my hats off to everybody for coming out here. You know, supporting us. Hats off to you. Thanks for having this. Oh, absolutely. This Twelve gauge podcast. You know, to get the stories out. Thank you to the PRCA Cowboy Channel. It, we all work together. And it's so awesome to see, and we won't give up. And it's been rough for all of us. You know, it's been a change for all of us. And, you know, we all help each other out, and we'll figure it out. Yeah, and, and that's kind of one of the interesting things that separates our industry from every other yeah. sporting industry out there is <laughs> – it's just, a, it's literally pick yourself up from the bootstraps and do it. Yeah. And it's right. like the other ones, no matter, you may be a sports fan like, like Ty is or like I am, they don't do that. Yeah. They just don't. They just move right. there, you know, or, or we'll do whatever it is that's trendy with everybody else. And our industry is 
screw that. We're going to go against the grain. <laughs> and then it still works. Right. right. I mean, the, for the fact that the PRCA pulled this thing off with uh, in this type of venue, I mean, <laughs> right. I half thought we were yeah. doing this at the E. I was like, yeah, yeah. Do oh, yeah. Thing. Yeah. That, e. Yeah. Like, absolutely. Something. Could you imagine that now? Like, that, that would have been terrible. Oh, yeah. A couple thousand. And yeah. Yeah. Yeah, well, and even that, like the fact that it's full round pay, you know, you right. have to thank the fans for that, for buying the tickets and showing up, because that was the key. I mean, mid-July, we were like, what, are we going to compete for $1,000 a night? Right. Which, I mean, that'd be, that'd be better than nothing, but it's like, what, what are we what are we out here rodeoing for? Right. And th- they didn't know, because they, had, they were still working on it daily. Right. No, I mean, absolutely. I mean... People could say what they want about George Taylor, but I mean, he stepped into <laughs> to that CEO position that's kind of always been filled by a specific type of person, right? And he comes in with this business background and, and he brings things and, you know, whether you like it or not, I mean, it is better for the industry. He is, he is so great for us. So I think great. he is. Yeah. I am, ve- we're very grateful to have George in and his wife. <laughs> yeah, 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 Chris, yeah, yeah, absolutely. Yeah. <laughs> Who doesn't love her? Yeah. Like she's like, 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 hey, George, step aside. She's, <laughs> yeah. she's the CEO. But, uh, no, I appreciate you taking the time to stop by. Congrats on the win. Um, I don't know yeah, what thanks. you could go do right now, but uh, <laughs> just just go back. I mean, you're probably staying at home. Right? Hey, we're we're clear of the COVID testing. We are going out tonight. We got the go around cel- uh, celebration at Texas Live. Yeah, um, yeah. Uh, quarantine is over with for me. I will see the fans <laughs> at Texas Live. My buddy Josh Ward's playing in Fort Worth. Might stop at the Huey party. There you go. <laughs> so oh, we haven't got a chance to go over there, but I heard it it worked out for those guys. I yeah. was wondering when they were going to do that. If, if if enough people would go to make it worth worth it for him, but it looks like it did. Yeah. Yes, sir. Well, all righty, guys. We're gonna let Tough get on with his night. He actually gets to have one and not just go <laughs> home. So uh, congratulations on the win. Glad you got it done. It was a beautiful, beautiful run. One of the fastest times we've seen the entire rodeo. So. Uh, who better to do it than you're truly <laughs> here? Um, yeah, have fun. Right on. Thanks, Bill. Uh, yes, you sir. bet. Absolutely. Guys, one thing is for sure, one thing I know for sure about myself and everybody in this room other than young Tyler is we are rural Americans, guys. Likes to hunt, fish, drive the back roads, drink the ice cold beers, go to the bonfires, has him a dog in the back. If you've got mud on your boots, Rural Cloth is the brand for you. Rural Cloth set out to create some of the highest quality clothing in the business, and they've got some great little taglines that We Grow Beer had is super popular. Thank you to Rule Cloth for the 20% off holiday discount that they're giving all the listeners to the Gage podcast. Go to rulecloth.com, type in the promo code Gage at checkout to get that 20% off. We've got till Saturday for you guys to use that. For some reason, if you're living under a rock, if you're not here with us, why that would be, I don't know. You'd be crazy not to be on this show right now listening. They've got 10% off for the remainder of the month. So if you do miss it, if you're one of those people, you come across this, I'm sorry you missed us, but go get that 10% off deal. It's Christmas.